actually hate. <laughs> Naturally, I'd be an introvert, so all my life I've been kind of quiet and I'd happily sit in the background and um, I suppose fell into hairdressing and loved it in the industry for 20 years and probably would have carried on until I like was knocked off, I'd say. Um, only for sometimes life just steps in, doesn't it? Things happen and they steer you in a different direction. A real crossroads, I think, in my life where um, I split up with somebody, sold the house, um, sold my car, sold everything and ended up with nothing. And I decided that I didn't want to go back to the salon and the world was changing and I thought this is a good time to do something new. I left school when I was 15, so I have no junior cert, not even cert, nothing, no education. Um, so I went back to college but had no money. So yeah, I suppose not having any money and thinking, let's just go for it. I needed courage to do that and I just put my head down and loads of grit and worked really hard and worked into the night and uh, that's how it happened, just started my business. I think I've lived in every crappy place around Dublin that you could possibly think of to try and save money to put into the business. And I set up the business with mobile service <laughs> online i had no wi-fi no money for wi-fi we had no laptop and i like i had no car so it didn't like all of that didn't stop me i thought i could still make this work i had the courage to do it i was like i'm, I'm ready I used to hang off the balcony stealing the wi-fi <laughs> from the community center across the road did everything on my phone um yeah it was a funny moment but you can make it work through anything you don't need anything to make it work Thing, always ask for help, like just always people to help you out. And I think women feel like they need to, you know, just know things. And so it's okay to ask for help. Uh, there's loads of people to help you out there. Um, and don't be afraid, just take the jump. Well, the worst that can happen is it doesn't work out and you go back to another job. Uh, just do it. I think courage comes from doing things even when people tell you that they, you can't do it, can't achieve it. Um, not listening, not living your life in other people's opinions. Um, looking at people who are telling you these things and saying to yourself, is, is their life matching what my life is that? Are they the type of people that you want to aspire to be? And if they're not, then there's no point in living your life according to their opinions or where, how they live theirs. didn't realise that the world was so big and the world could be a oyster, you could have had anything, especially when you're younger. Um, I think we're a product of our surroundings sometimes. I'd probably tell myself to hang out with people that were better than me and um, I do honestly believe that saying that you're like the five people you hang out with or surround yourself by and I probably would have surrounded myself with better people. More inspiring people, people that were um, encouraging and would push you and uh, yeah, the people that have your back, you know, and make you reach for the stars. Raven app is um, an online mobile beauty service. It's an app and website and allows you to book beauty appointments to come to you um, wherever you are all over Ireland.